Hey everyone, backstage here with Joey Cook at American <laughs> Idol. And I think the coolest thing about tonight is we have never seen a Car Kelly Clarkson song like that. So tell me kind of the inspiration behind kind of slowing it down, making it a little jazzy, reminding us of like a 20s uh, nightclub. Yeah, speakeasy style. Um, that's my comfort zone, that's what I'm good at. And uh, we, each, we went through the motions of doing it as is in vocal rehearsal and it sounded good, but it wasn't. It wasn't me. It yeah. wasn't. It didn't represent myself as an artist. And so Matt, um, who is the person who does helps me with arrangements, he's the accompanist for our vocal rehearsals. Um, kind of just started playing this walking bass line, and it all just fell into place in a matter of minutes. Um, of this is just what we're gonna do. Absolutely. And do you feel redeemed? Because I know last week they wasn't your best, um, but you were voted through, and you had a great night tonight. So do you feel like okay, I'm back. This is good. I do. I got. I got the. I got through the valley, and we are right back on the hill again. Yes. Yeah. I. I was not happy with last week. Um, it was a great time. Don't get me wrong. I had a great time dancing around and stuff. But vocally, it was not there. And uh, this week, I feel like I kind of reminded people what I'm doing here. So. Well, remind them of this bling you have on your finger. The babe. Miss uh, ah. engaged. So I know you. You had your fiance in the audience. You got engaged. That's exciting. It w was it a good excitement or was it more like? Dude, you couldn't have wait till after the stress of Idol. Are you happy that he did? It's actually really funny because we got engaged technically right before I auditioned for the show. Oh, wow. There was no, but there was no rings um, involved. There wasn't the knee thing. It was kind of just me and him sitting there going, "We've been together for almost six years now. We've <laughs> moved all over the East Coast together. Let's just get married. Yeah, let's just, let's just do it, you know." And um, I auditioned for the show right after that. Everything went crazy. The world turned into confetti called American <laughs> Idol. Yeah. And um, yeah, I kind of got lost lost in the in translation there and nothing really came of it. And then he kept telling me about my birthday surprise. My birthday was on Monday. Happy birthday. I'm having a great week right now. Yeah, it's nuts. Birthday. Yeah, so he kept telling me about my birthday surprise, birthday surprise. And this was my birthday surprise. So. What was the most exciting thing you did besides getting engaged for your birthday? Anything cool you got to see, do, relax, say? Yes. I went to the improv um, for a comedy show um, with Kyle Kinane, actually. He's my favorite comedian. Um, he was so amazing. It was one of the best comedy shows I've ever been to. I used to work at a comedy club, so I'm very picky about comedy. Picky about it. Yeah. Um, but, uh, yeah, it was one of the best comedy shows. Afterwards, we hung out with him. He, like, bought me and Evan beers, and we just talked. And, yeah, it was a nice, relaxing night out, having nothing to do with American Idol. Best week ever. Best week ever. Yes. Lastly, uh, what song would you get and lyrics would you get tattooed on your arm? Like a new tattoo. What is there a song lyrics that you definitely um, from a you know from an artist you'd you'd put on your body permanently? I don't think so. No. No. I am one maybe for maybe your first song. Maybe your first song. Mm, maybe. Yeah. If I got anything, it would be by a woman named Kimia Dawson. <laughs> That's I would I would get something from her that she's written. Um, but I'm not a big word person okay. for tattoos. I think so symbols good. symbols mean more to me. Personally. Well, she had a great week. It's her birthday. She's engaged and she's back next week here at American Idol. Mm -hmm. Wow! <laughs>